I think that feeling of well, like nothing matters because the world's dying anyway. It's really common <laughs> with people my age. Imogen began wearing this Princess Mononoke costume when she was eight. She wore it every day for the next four years. The whole energy of the wolf girl wanting to protect these amazing animals, that really resonated with me, even though I was really young. It's a huge thing that you and all your generation are growing up with. A lot of us will be affected. It's sort of harder to be hopeful. It's not like we can stop climate change. Sometime this century, these animals will go functionally extinct. We live every day as if nothing's changed. Do it just one more time. As if the lives of our children will be unharmed <laughs> and similar to our own. It's just really overwhelming how out of control things are. Like the bats. In a warmer world, they will also die faster. That one's dead. Right. You can't treat nature like that. School has been hard for her. Why should I even try to have a future? Changes aren't going to happen until people really start to hurt. I can't imagine being an adult in this world that's deteriorating. Getting Imogen through this last year of school is not going to be easy. I sort of just, just shut down at that point. One high school student's life is probably about to change. If this species can acclimate, it change its physiology to cope with that warming, perhaps it will survive. I think if you give up on everything, those feelings will get worse. As a parent, I just can't let it go. One bed at a time. I feel like if I can do anything to change anything, it's probably going to be through music. We're going to build a better town now.